Hey y'all, it's Trace here and I am just on my way today to go to Traverse Bay. So today we're going to talk about Grand Beach, Traverse Bay, possibly Bel Air, and who knows what else will come up on my travels today. Travels to Tracy. bit of a crazy day out today but the house I'm about to show is at 9 Eastland Drive and it's so close to this lake right here Lake Winnipeg you are steps away Whew, it's a gusty one out there today just want to say hey and uh, you know what Traverse Bay is amazing I've been driving around the area today and it is phenomenal there's so much to do here it's beautiful there's greenery and trees and tons of cabins great community if you ever thought about going to Traverse Bay let me know I'd love to show you some homes here hey it's Tracy and I'm here at 9 Eastland Drive in Traverse Bay look at this amazing cottage only 189,900 if you'd like to see it let me know Hey, it's Tracy and this is in Tracy's Travels. Uh, today I'm at the Victoria Beach area and this is in Manitoba, the East Beaches of Manitoba, right on Lake Winnipeg. And uh, this is a pretty unique community. It's got cabins and cottages all over the place. We're heading down to one of the beaches at Victoria Beach. So right now I'm at Victoria Beach and I'm at the Patricia Stairs uh, access point to the beach. You can see that the lake is just amazing. Um, it's one of the most beautiful areas in Manitoba and it's got that amazing Grand Beach sand, although we are at Victoria Beach. Take a look. This sand is famous around the world. It is powder lake. It's just incredible. So I'm still at Victoria Beach. Now I'm gonna head down to the King Edward Stairs. Hey all, it's Tracy again, and I'm now in the Sandy Bay area. So come on, let's go check it out. I just had a little bit of a scare. I'm pretty sure I'm seeing what is uh, bear tracks. So I'm just gonna head back to the car. Everywhere in these beaches, whether it's Victoria Beach, Bel Air Beach, Traverse Bay. There's tons of trails, lots of activities for families and anyone to do. There's lots of hiking to do, although hiking trails are currently closed at the moment. They will reopen and you will be able to enjoy yourself. This concludes this week's edition of Tracy's Travels. Follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube for more adventures in Manitoba.